Did you go grocery shopping? What'd you get? Wow, you got a lot of stuff. You got some good groceries right there, Popper, huh? What do you think? Happy Sunday, everyone. Pauline just got home from going to the grocery store with her parents. Um, that's their, gonna be their new Sunday tradition. Pauline and her father are gonna go to Aldi's and walk down the aisle of shame together and grab a few Aldi's specific items. We do 95% of our shopping at Wegmans, but there's some cool stuff at Aldi's that you can't get at Wegmans, so we go there for it. Um, Pauline and I are kind of feeling the doldrums of coronavirus, me especially. I've kept pretty positive about it through, through this whole thing. Today, it's like, I'm just kind of down in the dumps. I wanna get out and do something, so. We are gonna go to a couple places to go um, patio furniture shopping, and we're gonna go Best Buy. Um, it's gonna be a good day. We're gonna take the pupper with us, and uh, we're gonna go and have some fun together outside of the house. So we're gonna social distance and wear our masks, and we're gonna go try to see if we can find the perfect set of patio furniture for us to entertain and for me to go out and smoke cigars on. I'm ready to put this patio to use, people. Guys, I think Phil opened the week up for you. Now we're on an adventure. I'm so excited. I feel like Phil and I haven't gone on many adventures recently, so this this is fun. I feel like I'm smiling so much because we're going to some stores to look at furniture. Monday friends about to put my mask on <laughs> we are going into the post office and I also just came from dropping Zeus off and then picking up a little something at Ollie's totally not my store but I saw this yesterday because Phil thought there might be lawn furniture there there was not However, when I was walking by, they had these blush curtains and I had blush curtains picked out for my office that I wanted to get and these were only $16.99 for a set of two. So I got two of them because I just am gonna be a little short if they're spread out and I need to have the curtains closed. So I might return one, we'll see how it ends up looking when I'm done. But I'm going to be going into the post office now. I have some pin trades I got to drop off. And then I'm heading over to Target because I did a little searching around because I couldn't find a curtain rod at Ollie's. I don't ever want to go there again, but I'm glad I got this deal of <laughs> these curtains. So I searched around for a curtain rod and it seemed like Target had a really good price on one. So I'm going to go to Target. Any excuse to go to Target, right? <laughs> Happy Tuesday, friends. 
I got cut short last night while we were putting up the curtains. So I want to show you guys the final look. Mind my desk, it's a little messy from working today. So here are the curtains. I'm so happy, they're a nice blush pink color and I actually just used three panels. But I'm really happy how it looks with my chair. And I'm already planning on maybe putting a shelf in front of the curtain on the left hand side clear little gold hardware on it just to put maybe some display pieces because I really don't have anywhere to display stuff in here that's not on a wall. I also am going to show you another area. Again, mind my desk. I've been kind of did a little cleaning in here today. Um, but you can see all of my pins are displayed on this wall over here. And I have a, a board, you saw I purchased it the other day at Home Depot, that I want to put in between the two rows, although the top row is incomplete right now. I'm going to have three going across, but I want to put uh, a board in between with a quote. So let me show you what I mocked up on my computer. So I have it up here, it's kind of hard to see, but I want it in gold writing, and it's Probably gonna say, I don't know, I haven't 100% decided yet, but it says, Look at this stuff, isn't it neat? And I wanna have it sort of like a blush, brush strokey background to add a little texture and interest to the sign. I kinda have some like mermaid vibes going on in here because it's my room, so I kinda get to make it what I want, which is nice. And over there, it is my collection. My collection of pins so I want people to look at this stuff and think it's neat right my collection will never be complete so we're not using that quote <laughs> but now we are gonna be going off to dinner my parents and I are gonna go I think my brother is gonna come Phil's out of town so I'm gonna get some something yummy with my parents hello friends it's Wednesday and it has been far too long since I cooked dinner for you. <laughs> so I'm gonna film a little bit of our dinner like I normally do. I've been missing cooking it. I've got some catching up to do with the cooking also. I've had to pause the blue apron because they just keep coming and I can't keep up with it. So I gotta catch up. I've also had to like replace some of the items which kind of defeats the purpose but we'll see the the food has been lasting long and the quality has been staying so that's my fault that I just can't get to it quick enough on another note Phil is home he was only gone one day this week so normally it's for two nights but I'm happy to have him home I don't know why but I missed him more that he went this one night than I normally do when he's gone two nights. I think because he's been going so frequently recently because, I mean, COVID's not gone, but things have opened up more. So this is what's happening, this egg, cucumber, and smoked Gouda spread. Let's do it.
here's our dinner. There are these cucumber egg sandwiches. Should be interesting. Happy Thursday. Ugh. Do you ever just have one of those days where you just feel blah? You don't even know why? That's me today. I was having like some allergy stuff and a headache and just, ugh. So, huh, feeling a little bit better maybe? <laughs> uh, gonna make some dinner though. So let's check out what we're gonna make. So we have this Parisian style chicken and crispy rice. Looks yummy. Also, one thing I want to point out, our house is a little colder feeling today. So I have a spirit jersey on. That always makes me feel better. I put it on like 10 minutes ago and just feeling chipper now. the final chicken dish I tried this like a lemon sauce that's on top and it's so light and delicious I'm excited to try everything else hello friends it is Saturday I don't think I filmed a lot on Friday but let me show you what I did shrimp vegetables chicken corn quesadillas it's not the carol though because we don't have the it's okay, I wouldn't want to stay. So I'm pretty sure I just showed you some food we had, but worked during the day, went over to my parents' house, and then we had some fajitas that my dad made. They were delicious. But we watched a movie and then hung out in my dad's garage. He kind of has his garage set up like a bar slash lounge. We haven't hung out in there in a really long time, so it was fun to hang out there. Now it is Saturday, and today we actually went over our friend's house. We did like a social distancing, kind of just like hang out. We were outside, um, you know, sitting in some lawn chairs, just talking, staying distant. But it was nice to get out and see some people we haven't seen in a really long time. Very breath of fresh air. It felt like a good change of pace. I know more recently Phil has been like, done with the video game stuff, wanting just a change of pace. So I'm glad we're mixing things up a little bit and I think it'll make our vlogs a little more exciting too. But didn't really take you along on any of those sort of adventures quite yet. But I am right now because we are at Wegmans. So we are at the Pittsford Wegmans and we are eating at the food bar, which apparently they are closing the food bars, and I am very sad about because we absolutely love it. But Phil is getting us, I think, lobster rolls, and I'm gonna get a salad on the side or something of that nature. I'll show you when I get it, but the food here is always pretty good. And then Zeus is just hanging out with us. Let me show you our pup. So yeah, we are eating outside here at the Wegmans food bar. There is literally no one else here except that's Phil walking over. And yeah, Zeus is enjoying it, hanging out, stamp on patrol for everyone. Nice here is they bring the food right out to you. And we got this delicious lobster roll. The lobster to brun ratio seems pretty decent. And then garlic fries. Hi friends, Pauline from the future here. I vlogging lately. <laughs> well, I didn't close out a week vlog from like three weeks ago. So this is it. You're gonna see this pretty face a couple more times I have a feeling <laughs> because vlogging lately has been slightly challenging. I think I'm getting the seven month itch. Is that the thing? I seven year itch, seven month itch. Um, I have been vlogging since February, so that's seven months. It's pretty, pretty awesome. But 
lately i feel like i've been working on some changes improving my things with my business just trying to better myself waking up a little earlier focusing more uh, and with that I feel like the vlogging stuff has been a little bit less focused on so just trying to find a good balance of that and with that forgot to close out the video but I feel like the vlogs are shorter and all that fun stuff so trying to find a nice balance I love doing the week vlogs I will tell you getting to edit them though is like pulling teeth I don't know why I like filming them and then I like watching them but editing them is like not my most favorite part it's kind of like I would equate it to working out like I don't know about you but I'm just like oh I don't want to work out I'm not into it just don't want to do it and then when you're doing it you're like this wasn't so bad why did I make such a big deal about it same feeling with the editing I'm like procrastinating hating it and then I do it and I'm like why did I make such a big deal about that it's not a big deal I digress so anyways this is the ending for this video but you may see this pretty face a couple more times Pauline from the future closing out opening up weekly vlogs uh, because I've been kind of hashtag failing <laughs> so thank you so much for watching guys if you like this video please give us a big thumbs up comment below and tell me what was your favorite part about what we did in this vlog which was like three weeks ago for me <laughs> and be sure to give us a subscribe if you enjoyed this content we would love for you to join the mouse and mermaid family thank you so much guys i hope you have an awesome rest of your day peace love and quaharini